Lawrence Wendell, Larry Fowl, better known by his ring name, Lex Luger, is an American retired professional wrestler, television producer and football player currently working with WWE on their wellness policy. He is best known for his work with the National Wrestling Alliance, World Championship Wrestling, and the World Wrestling Federation. Luger is a three-time world champion, having held the WCW World Heavyweight Championship twice and the WWA World Heavyweight Championship once, and a five-time NWA WCW United States heavyweight champion who owns the records for consecutive days and total days as champion. Although he never won a championship in the WWF, he challenged for every title in the organization and was the 1994 Royal Rumble co-winner with Bret Hart. Pro Wrestling Illustrated readers voted Luger the most popular wrestler of the year for 1993 while he was contracted to the WWF. Luger was one of the most successful and popular superstars of the 90s and played a major role in the Monday Night Wars era. Football career Luger attended high school and played football in Orchard Park, New York. He then attended Pennsylvania State University on a football scholarship, but transferred to the University of Miami after his freshman year where the Penn State coaches thought he should move to linebacker or defensive end. A talented soccer player and lifelong fan of English soccer team Manchester United, Luger considered changing sports for some time but eventually decided his skills would be better suited to football. He sat out the 1978 season as a redshirt transfer student in Coral Gables. In 1979, Luger played for the Miami Hurricanes, which featured future NFL Hall of Fame quarterback Jim Kelly, Jim Burt, Mitch Guitar, Fred Marion and Mark Richt. He was booted off the team for what Luger referred to as off-the-field incidents, specifically on the team's road trip to Atlanta to play Georgia Tech. Luger, suffering from cabin fever and disappointed at not being named as starter by coach Howard Schnellenberger by that fifth game into the season, snapped and trashed his hotel room. Upon leaving Miami, he played professional football for the Montreal Alouettes of the Canadian Football League where he played in the 67th Grey Cup against the Edmonton Eskimos. He then signed with the Green Bay Packers of the National Football League but never played in a game and thus is not listed on their all-time roster. Though he did spend the entire 1982 season on the team's injured reserve list with a groin problem incurred during training camp, he returned to the Packers training camp in 1983, but he was released before the regular season began. Luger wore number 66 for the Packers, the last player to do so before it was retired for Ray Nitschke. In 1984, Luger finished his football career playing in the United States Football League for the Tampa Tampa Bay Bandits, Memphis Showboats and Jacksonville Bulls. He was a teammate with future WCW rival Ron Simmons while playing for the Tampa Bay Bandits.